Hello guys and welcome back to another video with me SliversFX and this Gothic 2 New Balance mod. Today we're going to be doing the quest, the mystery of the old book. If you have rescued Ragnar from starvation in chapter 1 or 2 near the Death Harpy Tavern and then helped him becoming a fire mage, he will give you a specific book where you can actually gather up a few pieces of a staff or a rod uh, with which you can summon your own fighting dragon, like a pet. And, uh, well, even though it's a bit late, you could have used it a long time ago, let's say chapter 2 or 3, uh, it's still kind of cool. So we're going to do that. Okay, so the book is called Phantom Flame. And when you open it, the, uh, the quest starts. I already have it here. And the second thing we need to do is go to the tower near the eastern forest <clears throat> i'm gonna just go here and show you what to do next so this is the tower of creole the uh, the necromancer in uh valley of mines and he left a note behind i think it was here on this table i already picked it up and once you find this note it will say note an old piece of paper with incomprehensible notes and once you read this it says untangible text creole untangible text and the quest will update the next thing you need to do is go to creole himself in the valley of mines and continue your quest from there you will ask him about this specific note that you just found but you cannot really read and he will tell you about the process of summoning your own fighting dragon okay so he asks you to bring him four pieces even though he wouldn't give you the last one but that is a lie i already have the four pieces but let me show you where to find them so the first piece is with the necromancer at the temple of the sleeper at the end in chapter three you get it okay i already done this video quite a while ago so if you haven't done it this would be a good time the second fragment is with Kor Kalom in the Masyaf Slayer. Uh, this is the assassin plot where you go through the quest of missing novices and at the end there will be a boss called Kor Kalom. The third chart is with the Lord of Shabbos in Nubis. We did this in the previous episodes, I think, uh, where we called the, uh, the Undead Invasion. And the tomb of Lord Inubis is literally right next to Owner's Farm. And the last one, of course, is with Creole. And once you get it, you can talk to him. You give him all the pieces of the rod, and the he gives them of all the of them back to you. You get 3,000 experience. Yes! Okay. So the last thing that's needed is uh, an eye of a dragon. Now, if you've already killed the uh, shadow dragon in the Shadow Valley, Asgalor, then that would be already accomplished. There's also another way. You can also try to do the cross of elements. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do that quest, but this is the quest that includes Ashtar's suicide. So if you know Ashtar is the dragon from... Uh, from the Jarkandar area, a separate area, of course. And once you have all of these pieces in your inventory, you can go to any blacksmith anvil. Of course, you need a uh, steel molten rod. And you can combine them in a special area called Other. And you have the Dragon Lord's Staff. So we get Dragon Skull, four pieces of the rod, and a Dragon's Eye. And we're going to combine it into a Dragon Lord Staff. Once you combine the staff, it will become available in your inventory. It's about here-ish between the uh, the runes and all of your rings and uh, trinkets. It's going to be called the Dragon Lord's Staff. And you need 450 mana to actually summon the dragon. Now, I don't have it because I am a scout. I, I did not focus on having any mana. I only have 240. But for those that 
actually play a mage or maybe just um, a battle mage, then you can actually use this one. The dragon itself is a standard model, but I think it has around 15,000 HP or so and does quite a bit of damage. The only problem is that when you're moving with him, he's very slow. That's the only issue. So this is only good in theory, but it's still very cool that it was implemented. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe for more future content. And as always, thanks for watching.